How's it going guys? It's Flynn here from Backyard Blasters. In today's video we're going to be doing a custom paint job on the 1911 foam dart gun. So we'll head straight outside and get into it. Alright guys, so I've just taken out the screws and I just wanted to show you how to take this apart. Basically, once you've emptied out the screws, you've undone them and pulled them out, you're just going to separate the slide. I'm trying to do this one-handed. Much easier with two hands. Alright, here she comes. Here's, oh, there we go. Beautiful. Alright, so the slide is apart. So now you've got... There's the toy gun. That's what it looks like without the slide. This spring here. This goes into this little notch here, so when you reassemble it to make sure that goes through the spring, um, that, that allows the slide to um, slide back forward. So that is important. There's the plunger tube, as you can see, that's what is pulled back by these little tabs there on each side of the slide. All right, so let's move that out of the way. So we have our two slides here. Okay. So now we'll be ready to spray paint it. So what we're going to have to do is shake up the spray paint can and prepare it and we'll be ready to go. Alright guys, so we've shaken up the spray can here. Now remember to always do this outside, never do this inside, you want to be in a ventilated area. So I'm just outside on the lawn, plenty of fresh air. So now we're about to apply the spray paint. Remember you want to hold it around 30 centimeters away and you want to apply even pressure to the nozzle otherwise it'll splutter and it will just you'll get drips of uh, paint onto the slide so you just want to be aware of that all right here we go Okay, so now we're going to just let it sit for a while. Um, I did an okay job, I think. <laughs> let me just zoom out. There we go. It may have gone a little heavy on the paint there. As you can see, it's filled in the, um, the foam dart gun words there on the slide. Alright, so we're just going to have to let that sit for probably an hour. Um, and then we'll be able to reassemble it. All right guys, so here's the finished product. I'm just going to clip it onto the toy gun. Show you what it looks like. So there's one of the slides. There's the second. So I'll clip those onto the toy gun and we'll see what it looks like. All righty guys, so I've just gotten in out of the sun. Uh, this is a finished product, so as you can see, the orange and black do look quite cool um, together. Yeah, nice contrasting colours. And this the spray paint enamel has a very, very nice shine to it, and it's actually very um, quite nice to grip to as well. Now, there's not actually that much friction between here which is where it's uh, where it cocks back that still works fine and if you wanted to you can actually remove other parts of the toy gun like the trigger here you can spray that orange you can also remove the bottom clip and spray that orange now you notice this piece is actually glossy so uh, you may want to actually sand that before spray painting it so there we go Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, just leave them down in the comments section below. Thanks for watching guys, and we'll see you next time.